because everyone across the country are looking for these PPEs. It's making, um, uh, and we just can't rely on the shipment that we're getting from FEMA. Uh, the city of Houston, like others, are going to the private marketplace. And I will tell you, it becomes a bidding war on the private marketplace. Because what is happening, for example, we had a shipment, um, we, well, we had uh, entered into an agreement uh, to purchase a number of PPEs, a large quantity, for example, at $4. And then we were notified, for example, today, uh, that someone had bid it more uh, than that, and they were not going to follow through or honor that agreement. Uh, and so we've had to go to another a potential supplier, uh, and it does it doesn't come, uh, and it becomes very costly. So to give you an example, we have now put forth another request uh, for PPEs, the N95 mask, uh, at a, at a cost of about two million dollars alone, uh, and these masks are costing us about five dollars and fifty six cents a piece. Uh, and we are hoping that that agreement, our understanding, will be followed through and people want to be paid up front, okay? This is not where they are saying, you know, uh, send us a small deposit and then when you get your supply, they want to be paid up front. But the reality is because there's such a demand uh, for this equipment and we need them for our first responders and so many others, uh, we're having to pay more because we're having to go to the private marketplace